Hey there, this is Karan Singh and I'm going to show you the workflow which I use to import my animated Cinema 4D objects into Adobe Aero. Now the first thing you want to do obviously is make sure you're happy with your animation. Uh, you also want to make sure that you've keyframed all your components ready for the export. Once you've done all that, head to File, select Export and the FBX extension. In the dialog box, just make sure tracks and materials are selected. And once you're satisfied with the options, hit OK and save it in a folder. Once that's done, we'll jump into Adobe Aero. So now that I've fired up Adobe Aero, I'm ready to import the FBX. So I select File, Import, and choose the FBX file that I created from Cinema 4D. Once the file is in place, I'm ready to add some behaviors to it. So down here, I'm gonna choose Behavior Builder. In my case, I'd like the animation to be triggered by the user's proximity to the object. So I'm gonna select Proximity, and I'm gonna say that when the user is within 20 centimeters of the object, I'd like the animation to trigger. Next, I'd like it to trigger the animation, and I'm gonna add another action, which is Play Animation. You'll notice that the animation is already preloaded in to the FBX file, so you don't actually have to assign anything here. So once you hit play up here, you should see that the animation's working. The only addition I'm gonna make is to make sure that it plays infinitely. Then we're ready to preview the experience. And once we enter the proximity, the animation should trigger. I hope this helped. Thanks so much for watching and you can check out the Soundgarden experience by scanning the QR code. See ya.